Hello beautiful people. Welcome back to my channel Wake Up Bright where I share all of the things that help me live each day a little brighter. I'm April Lauren and I'm on a journey to lose 200 pounds. Today's video is sponsored by Squarespace. So we're gonna take a look-see at the blog. And today is a full-blown snow day. A snow day on my weight loss journey and I'm pretty darn excited about it. Let's get into today. starting today with making some pre-workout which I end up not really having for hours. <laughs> I am making my pre-workout and then taking care of the babies and making some breakfast. I'm making oats but it's gonna be more of a savory oats dish so I'm just doing a fourth a cup now with the oats and we're gonna see how that goes and yeah. Well, now that I have made my little weird bowl, <laughs> I am um, gonna eat it. I'm gonna eat a banana. So I was feeling a little hungry. I'm not really sure why, but I decided to have a banana before I did my workout and the hubs was outside running. It's been nice having him home. I know he's ready get back to a normal schedule kind of he kind of likes being home I think and kind of doing his own thing too so but he was out in the garage running and I decided to warm up by cycling and then I had a circuit I was doing and I'm also doing the Chloe Ting hourglass challenge and this was the first day of that challenge oh and I figured out how to look up the previous workout so before I got started I was able to look up my time so from the 10 miles in 30 minutes so I thought that was pretty cool I didn't know you could do that and because of my my extreme like emotional release I didn't grab any kind of like footage at the time <laughs> I was preoccupied with hyperventilating and it felt amazing to like it's it's such a weird thing because in that moment there was so much joy and then as soon as I like started to laugh, like as soon as I stopped and I like I, I remember smiling and I was so happy and then it just exploded and um, it just really it was a little distracting. It was a little distracting, but it felt good to warm up and after I warmed up, I started my circuit and then I got distracted. I started doing my circuit and I re remembered that I wanted to put on some flat shoes. So I went inside to do that and ended up going outside to play with the babies. So I get everything ready 
and then I abandon ship and I come and finish my workout later. So, I mean, I had done 20 minutes of cardio at this point and then I just went outside not long after the husband went inside. You want to go out? This way. Come on. All right, come on, come on back. Come on. Good boy, boo boo. Come on, inside. Inside. Good boy. Good boo. So after we played outside, I decided I wanted to make the hubs and I some lunch before I got started working because I did have quite a bit of work that I wanted to get done. He was studying and doing homework and things and preparing for an exam that he has coming up should they ever get to go back to school. <laughs> the snow is, it's shut down, shut down so many roads, but 
So we just got a shipment in of my husband's soaps. We order from, I think it's like called Swatch or something. We order like deodorant and soaps and things from them. And I used a, several of the soaps that we got for a tripod. And so it's just in this shot randomly. But I thought a simple little lunch, some broccoli. And then these are actually low carb tortillas that I got. And they're so, they're really good. And so I just did a little cheese, some chicken that I had already prepped. And that's the same thing I did with breakfast. It's the same prepped chicken. And yeah. Lunch turned out super good. I really enjoyed it. It wasn't quite as many calories as I had planned on eating. But the main thing that I was working on today is figuring out how I want to structure my website. So I scheduled a photo shoot and I got sick so I had to push it, which that actually turned out really good because now I want to figure out what exact, what photos I need for the site. I know there's some very specific things that I wanna do here just to improve like anyone's experience who's interested in my journey and even my future self if I'm looking back. Y'all can see her hair all over the floor, but she's so freaking cute. She is always under me. My girl, she is definitely my girl. So I have just been working and working. This blind situation is not the best. But I have been working trying to figure out how best to lay out my website. What I think I want to do is section it out so that if I want to look back on my journey and just look at the monthly updates that I can. And then I think I'll also do like maybe some write up, up some more like journaling or details within like blog posts, but then section them all together so that you can click on one link and like look at all of the way in Wednesdays or all of the one mile for time videos or all of whatever videos, all of my full day of eating videos or my current eating plan. I think that that'll be really cool if I can get my website organized like that. So just nailing down a structure so that when we do the photo shoot, I don't have any holes. Like I have photos for every page that I need photos for and the type of photos that I need for that page. Today's video is sponsored by Squarespace. So I have been working on my blog that will go up alongside of this video. And I'm so excited. It's the last week of February and I cannot believe it's already here. But I'm gonna put up the workouts for February on my blog and then also on my blog will be just some thoughts. Some thoughts I've had <laughs> over this month of trying to make it past that fitness cliff that I've talked to you guys so much about. But Squarespace is so awesome. I It meets all of my website needs as far as if I wanna create an online store, I can. If I wanna do email campaigns, I can. Right now, I mostly use it uh, to share information and for my blog. So, which I, once I got everything up and created, I started using my phone to manage. So if you have an iOS or an Android device, you can download the app. And essentially, it's gonna look a lot like the back end looks on your computer. So I have the option to work from my computer or I can work from my phone. If you have iOS or Android devices, you can download the app and manage your site from your phone, which is super convenient. I also love that it was very easy for me to add 
Pinterest tag so that any pictures that people want to add to Pinterest, they can. Also, the system is set up for social sharing, which it just makes everything so easy. And it's very simple to link up your social networks. Also, there are so many options as far as designs with Squarespace. I really, really love my Squarespace site. And I hope when it's all done I, that you love it too. If you would like to get a Squarespace website, go to www.squarespace.com backslash April Lauren or use code April Lauren to save 10% off of your first website or web domain purchase. Once I finished working, I went back out to the gym and started my workout, and I really enjoyed this circuit. I tried to focus on going slow. I do have the footage sped up a little, but I'm just trying to really work on a few things I've noticed, especially with dropping my core when I squat. So I haven't been adding extra, like I, I have the bar of course, but I haven't been adding extra weight to my back squats just because I've noticed that I drop my core just a little bit. It's like I take a breath at the bottom. So I've been working on that and with the cold, my left leg where I've had the knee surgeries and the ankle and the fibula surgeries, it's, um, <laughs> it's, it's not enjoying the negative degree weather to say the least, but I, I am very excited. I think soon in the next couple days, it'll be back to normal. The snow will melt and you know, and I will be able to work out together and I'm really looking forward to when that happens. So, and then I'm also really excited about Chloe Ting challenge hourglass I haven't done a Chloe Ting challenge since October so it's been a while and it felt like that's all I was doing for a minute was Chloe Ting challenges but they're a lot of fun I did the first workout earlier today which I'll show you guys the footage of that and I was elated at how much more I was able to do and part of it's just it's a different workout but before the core exercises I couldn't do I couldn't do any of them. I could definitely couldn't do where you like lay on your back and then you lift your your butt up off of the ground a little and that it just would not have happened. But there's just, I'm so happy with my progress, with my mobility and the things that I'm capable of doing now that I wasn't even in October. So I just really excited. I am gonna end the video with working out today. That's just how the cookie crumbles. It was a great snow day. I enjoy playing with my pups. They are so tuckered out. It's really, really sweet <laughs> that, that they like playing in the snow so much. Like they play for hours just by themselves. And then when I was out there, we were out there for, I don't know, maybe like an hour, hour and a half or so and it was just fun. Sorrel boots for the win. I do not have a winter coat, but with my boots, I stayed so warm between my boots and my hair. I definitely feel better. I felt better during the video that I shared with you. When I had that release, it definitely, I think one, acknowledging my feelings and just sharing it, made me feel better. And then having that release of emotion, I think it's just stuff that was bottled up and it just all came flooding out. And it was like, it was just everything. It was joy and sadness and it just, it erupted. I mean, you guys saw it. And that's why I shared, shared it because I thought it was powerful that, and like the whole time I'm talking throughout that video, I had no idea that I was gonna get to that point. Like I really was looking forward and just kind of, dreading dreading the wait until spring but I think it's I think it's all okay I'm gonna be just fine and I'm so blessed I'm so blessed to have so many wonderful people watch and support and encourage me on my journey that's it's an amazing blessing and I am grateful for each and every one of you and I am gonna go ahead and end the video here I hope that you know how wonderful you are, you are worth it. We are all worth the work it takes to live healthier, happier, and brighter lives. 
week four for fituary is up on my blog and it doesn't matter if you've done any fituary week before you're welcome to participate and I hope that you do if you want to follow along on my journey click subscribe ding the bell so you'll be notified and if you enjoyed my little snow day vlog today please give me a thumbs up I love you guys I love you so much and I will see you next time